first good so what's up guys welcome back again to another youtube video and i'm very very excited about this episode now whatever you've just seen is just some little part of nairobi and in this video today i want us to talk about nairobi and maybe a little bit about mombasa so recently i've seen a lot of vlogs try to compare nairobi or kenya or rather kenya to any other country i don't have any problem with that but i know at least i can share more information about this country because I've lived in this country for the longest time, I mean, ever since I was born. <coughs> Nairobi is the capital city of Kenya. We also have other cities like um, Kisumu, Mombasa, Nakuru, and other, other towns are trying to maybe pull up their socks so that they can attain the city status. So when it comes to Kenya and or, or Nairobi in general, there is a plan for development. Uh, there is a vision 2030 plan. That is the reason why you are seeing a lot of development are taking place. A lot of infrastructures are also coming up. A lot of buildings are being constructed. A lot of hospital, development of railway station, and also expansion of existing roads. And uh, it's because of this reason that uh, a lot of people are find it easy when they come to Nairobi, um, very easy for them to settle, very easy for them to to uh, run their run their daily daily um, work, and um, it is very easy to work in Nairobi. It's very easy to settle here in Nairobi. It's very easy also to if you have a company, it's very easy for the company to grow. I mean, that is the reason why a lot of people find it easy to invest, work, and live in Kenya. I know I have a lot to say, but I don't want to say so much. I want you guys to see what is happening with this city. The city is beautiful. I love the skyline. I love everything about this city. And I'm sure you guys are going to enjoy this video. But first, let me show you just a little bit more of this beautiful city of Nairobi before we jump to Mombasa, that is. So let's do this. So what do you think about Nairobi guys after seeing that video? I know all of us have different opinion and um, someone like me, I was like, I was not appreciating Nairobi. I was not like happy about Nairobi. I always needed more. But, I, but after seeing a lot of videos outside, after seeing, a lot, uh, after seeing how people are impressed about this city, I mean, I just have to look back and relax and, and be like, hmm, I've been taking this country for granted. 
and a lot of people are even coming in this country and they are appreciating whatever they are seeing here. I saw another video somewhere that um, someone was saying that in Nigeria there is a lot of blackout and let me tell you one thing, if there is blackout in Kenya, it's once or twice in a month or sometimes none because there is a system in place. I saw another video, uh, a lady, I like watching a channel, uh, what's her name, what's her name? Name. I'll, I'll pin I'll, I'll pin the I'll just tell you a, a channel down here in the description box she was saying that she was so surprised when she came to Kenya and saw the system in place now she was used to the left hand drive and now she's coming to Kenya and she's seeing the right hand drive and the system and the infrastructure that is in place the transportation system I mean there are these things that we have and we don't feel happy about that there is this thing that the country has and we don't appreciate them until someone else from another country comes talks about them and we are like hmm so we are that privilege enough of that no let's get to Mombasa Mombasa is one of the oldest town in Kenya and it is it was also the capital city of Kenya before Nairobi took over and the funniest thing about Mombasa Mombasa is in an island you see so Mombasa town is in an island. I've been to Shanzu, I've been to Kunda, I've been to South Coast. I've be, I've stayed in Mombasa CBD and uh, I must say generally if I have to choose between Nairobi and Mombasa, I'll say I'll work in Nairobi and go to holiday in Mombasa because who doesn't like the beach of course. Oh my god. Wow. It's very easy to commute. It's very easy to connect between those two cities. It's very easy to commute from Nairobi to Mombasa. The accessibility makes it very, very user friendly, and uh, every Kenyan can be able to travel in less than six hours. And also with comfort travel, you can book your flight, or you can also access Mombasa through the Makada Madaraka Express, that is uh, the train. And this is what makes a city. If I can commute from Nairobi. To Mombasa and back to Nairobi at the same day I mean what else what else do I want I can work in Nairobi go to holiday in Mombasa I mean that is what it means to have a city and not just a city two interconnected city the SGR project was one of the best project and uh, I'm very happy about it talking about Mombasa these are the kind of things that you should do when you go to Mombasa you should try the seafood. You should try. Uh, when I mean the seafood, there's um, tamarind boat ride. I went there sometimes back, and the experience was amazing. It was lovely, and I loved it. So Mombasa is it's a good city. Everything is not moving as fast as Nairobi because when I semaga was ni pole pole. So it is good for having fun. It's good for holiday. But for me, if I want to work. I'll always choose Nairobi. Nairobi has taught me everything I know. Nairobi has mentored me in so many ways. Nairobi has disciplined me in so many ways. Nairobi has made me the kind of man I am today. So I owe everything that I have, I owe everything to, that I know to these streets of Nairobi. So I don't want to talk much, but let me show you just a little bit of Mombasa. And you guys, if you are new here or if you are watching this video for the first time, my name is Pelino Isaac. I'm a video creator. Uh, here is the link to my, my social media handles. You can find me uh, on Instagram at Pelino Isaac. I'm a drone pilot. I love creating. So before you leave, ensure that you give this video a thumbs up. Ensure that you share this video. And ensure that you also hit that subscribe button because I'm nothing without you and you're my support system and I really like it when I come back here and create more content. So enjoy Mombasa and see you next time. Cheers.